dojos are at the center of this controversy. What's up, guys? Dave from Team Rubicaba Network, TRN Cobra Kai Theories. What's up, guys? Thanks for joining another episode. Oh, my God. So I saw this. I saw this a couple days ago, and I'm just like, what? But uh, I didn't have time to do a video on it, so I'm doing it now. And so I think it's very fitting that we are going to talk about my boy Dimitri and Yasmin. And so I do, I wish guys, and you guys are all gonna, when you see the interview that I did with Gianni, this was done, that interview was done on December 22nd. So it was before this was released, cause if it, I had known, I would've asked him about that kiss, man. But so I didn't know about that. So it was having a shock to me after doing an interview with Gianni to see this, I was like, what? My boy, Dimitri, handling business. So, uh, man, can you believe can you believe this? So I'll start the slideshow right now. I just want to give some shout outs as usual. Make sure to check me out on social media. All those links are in the, in the description. Cobra Kai Fanatics, the group is growing every single day. So thank you guys so much. I appreciate you guys being there. I pre appreciate everything you guys are doing. Cobra Kai Phantom, as usual, man, much love to you. I love your animations. They're amazing. Watch Party, always killing it. Banzai Kai Dojo. Cobra Kai Companion, do a lot of interviews, guys. The Chosen One. Cobra Kai Kid. And just make sure you guys check them out. I gotta update, update their slides. And Cobra Kai Studio. I gotta update everyone's slides because they've grown since I think I grabbed those, which were like a month ago, man. Everyone's kind of growing. So let's get into taking a look at this it's gonna be kind of a short video guys i just want to talk about a little bit about this and what it might mean for dimitri himself and so let's kind of get into this so baller uh that that skipped really quick that'll it's okay guys it'll come back so we saw that image of dimitri kissing yasmin right we see that i believe it was an ad i don't know who to give credit to it um i believe i saw this one on uh I think it was either Watch Party, maybe Bonsai, there it is. It was one of them. I, I can't remember who I saw it first on because I was trying to catch up on videos. But man, <laughs> what does this mean? So let's talk a little bit about where Dimitri is going, man. That's a perfect picture. We see his evolution specifically from season one to where he's at now. Feeling very confident with uh, what he's learned with Miyagi-Do, learning at least the basics. And I want to tell you guys, man, I still do not understand why people have so much hate for him knocking out Hawk. He kicked his butt, man. It's plain and simple. Like, I don't get It's like watching a fight and somebody loses by a KO in the 12th round. And we're just like, yeah, but still for 12 rounds, he was beat. It doesn't matter. He lost. Hawk lost the end so i just don't i don't understand the logic now if we see dimitri get pounded up in season three which is a very real possibility well then yeah man you guys can be saying hawk beat him up but black and white he lost the fight with dimitri right and ever since that we've seen the evolution of this character dimitri from roasting him at the party to the the, the epic battle in season two finale and now we see in season three that he's kind of manned up and he's confronting hawk i didn't put it in here but the image of them standing in the hallway face to face and you see zero fear in his eyes this character is evolving and now and now for the first time he gets the babes right as johnny lawrence would say is she hot <laughs> so he gets the babe now i'm gonna say i wasn't surprised and i and i remember people saying this even a year and a half ago man he's gonna hook I, I'm not gonna say that I was surprised because of who Yasmin is, like, and her character and her status. And now to see this dorky dude like beat the hell out of Hawk, I think she, I think he became very attractive to her, you know, because that's kind of that's the world that she lives in, man. And so if if that's what happens, more power to my boy Dimitri. But and here's a but. How is that going to increase conflict between these two dojos? And how is it going to pan its way out? So I, I'm not 100% sure right now. I know definitely for him, high five. All right, man. 
Gianni, Gianni, why didn't you tell me this happened when we did this interview, man? Why didn't we? The whole interview would have been about this, this kiss. <laughs> that interview is coming up on Monday, uh, the 28th, December 28th. So stay tuned, you guys. The premiere will be put out so you guys can hit that reminder. But man, this whole conversation probably would have been about this. But just to see his growth and his evolution and now to finally get the girl, the girl, there's only one place to go. And that's down, man. Once you reach the pinnacle, once you make it to the top, everyone's trying to tear you down. So I'm, I'm curious to see how that plays out. But congratulations, Dimitri. You finally got the girl, man. I really, I'm super excited for you. Uh, I just, I, I thought it might happen, but I was like, man, there's no way. There's no way that's going to happen. And it did. So, um, but what's interesting about these characters, especially like Kyler and Yasmin, uh, it's great to see them back and I think it was more specifically the time frame in season two and, and it was very like the summerish and there, there's all those reasons as to why they were not brought back so now we have this fresh new year that started with a hell of a fight and then we see it progress into other things so I'm really excited to see these characters come back and I actually did do a, a prediction and I don't even remember exactly because it was so long ago it was about a year and a half ago about Yasmin uh, in after season one and then we never saw her we never saw her so I wonder if I go back and watch that if that still kind of carries weight but um, thanks for tuning in for another episode guys like I said some of these are gonna be short I just wanted to get out to you and respond to all of these uh, these things so if you think Dimitri is the man I want you to put in here man Dimitri is the man in the comments if you think this is nonsense don't leave a comment because I don't really care. I'm no, just kidding. Uh, but uh, stay tuned, you guys. More episodes coming. And I do want to talk about the roundtable and, uh, and read some comments with you guys. So that is coming. Stay tuned. And I want to release that very, very soon. Appreciate all the love. If you have not seen that, the roundtable, check it out. One of the coolest things that I've been involved with this, this far in my uh, doing Cobra Kai and it's just remarkable to hear all these different perspectives so make sure to check that out you will not be disappointed I promise you that all right guys I'm gonna get on out of here until next time we'll talk to you soon I'm out <laughs>